Hello. Something I'd like to share with you today that comes right out of God's Word. From our daily reading, right in uh, Ephesians chapter 3, we can see in verse 12 that Paul encourages us in whom we have boldness and access with confidence through faith in Him. Beloveds, there are storms. Uh, and I don't just mean uh, uh, Storm Ida that has slammed uh, the East Coast and hit Louisiana really badly. I mean, there are lots of storms in our lives, in our relationships, in our place of work, because of COVID, because of stress, because of all of these things, there are storms circling around us. And so I would encourage you to be leaning into that access that you have to God the Father, to the throne room of grace. We have that access only because of our faith in Christ. And with that faith, I want you to lay a hold of those promises and not let go. I love that right here in uh, Ephesians chapter 3, he says, For this reason I bow my knees to the Father, our Lord Jesus Christ, from whom the whole family in heaven and earth is named, that he would grant you, according to the riches of his glory, to be strengthened through his Spirit in the inner man, that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith, that you, being rooted and grounded in love, may be able to comprehend with all the saints what is the width and length and depth and height, to know the love of Christ that surpasses knowledge, that you may be filled to the fullness of God. Now to him who was able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us, to him be the glory in the church of Jesus Christ for all generations, forever and ever, amen. I would encourage you today not to pray for comfort, not to pray for ease, not to pray for those troubles to disappear, but pray for God's will and the strength to carry out that will today. And know that we're standing right here alongside you. Take care, beloveds.